Hey everybody, how you doing? Welcome to the channel. Got a video for you today. Going to be reviewing and unboxing the Zippo Yellow Flame Pipe Insert. They're brand new, just came out a couple weeks ago. Uh, I got these sent to me by my boy Lippy. Thank you so much, man. Appreciate it. Uh, you can't get these in Canada right now. And they're only in the States on eBay. They don't even have them on the Zippo website. So... Thank you so much for getting me. I'm probably the first person in Canada to have these right now. If you got one and you live in Canada, um, let me know down in the comments. Also, uh, I've been getting this requested a lot. Uh, you guys let me know if you guys want me to take apart a yellow flame and take apart a uh, torch uh, torch insert like this uh, for a video. People have been asking me constantly how to take them apart. They want to do things and change things. I actually might be you may be able to customize mine and add in a couple little gold things so let me know down in the comments if you want to see that video so let's get on with the review as you know bang baby i got two of these <laughs> very excited about this now let's take a look at the box before we open this and go any farther does not contain butane insert is empty yellow flame pipe butane lighter insert genuine uh Look at these. These are funny. Built to last. <laughs> uh, reusable. Pocket size. Well, yeah, it's a Zippo. What isn't pocket size about it? I think they needed to fill a square. Uh, reliable spark. Well, we'll see about that. And easy ignition. Like I said, again, we'll see about that. The yellow flame uh, inserts tend to have some cheap Chinese flint in them. And you can't, whenever you try to use the yellow flame, it won't spark up because of this cheap flint as soon as you change it to a brand new zippo flint works fine i don't know why i don't know what that is about it and let's just read the back too blah 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 all right done oh what's this say at the bottom see detailed instructions inside yeah okay <laughs> won't be needing those not around here all right here's my detailed instructions and warranty Oh man, I cannot wait to get my hands on this thing. Get out of the box! Finally! Oh man. This thing is dope. Alright. Let's see. Where's the date on this one? Oh, this is the first Zippo thing I have from 23. A23. Oh man, that's sick. Okay, uh, let me get butane. Gotta get my good stuff here. So let's see how it fills up. And I'll show you guys how I fill it up. I do it for about 10 seconds. Uh, filling, filling, filling. There. Always make sure your insert's upside down when you're filling too. It helps the butane move into it very easy. Don't try to fill it like that or sideways. Always go upside down. All right. Well, I'm going to take out my double torch. See you later. <laughs> Might never use you again. Oh, man. Look how nice that brand new insert looks. Oh, yeah. Fits like a glove. No flame adjuster. Oh, it comes out big and perfect. This thing is awesome. Man, that thing is cool. Uh, expect yours to get dirty there. See how mine already had to sit there? Expect it to get dirty. Uh... Now, they do have the same plastic uh, cam spring. Sorry, <laughs> I was drawing a blank there. They do have the cam, the cam spring. Now, let's see how this adds up to... Let's see how this adds up to a yellow flame insert. Let's see what the looks are. I just wanted to feel the weight. They both feel equally heavy. Uh, and like you can see, they are basically identical inserts. The buttons are all the same. Cams are all the same. Same gray one. Same buttons. Same flint wheel. But it looks like this flint wheel is bigger because it's more open here. This flint wheel is actually covered a bit, so don't let that fool you. Uh, it's been lighting up first strike every time. Now, I want to think why that does it is because of the side hole of the containment. That's probably really the reason. 
And as you can see, I've been using this for a year. They do hold up well. Uh, see, but my yellow flame doesn't light up every single time like this does. Uh, that gives me reason to believe, like, look, every single time, every single time, whatever the problem was, Zippo clearly listened, clearly fixed it. Like, look, it just, it lights up every time. This has got to be, oh, the first time, but I sw I actually slipped off the button there. If you put that in slow-mo, that one did. That one did. But regardless, it's pretty much lighting up every single time, except that time. Like, man, th when they say reliable, they mean it. Easy ignition, for sure. Uh, I really, really love the Zippo, and I'm going to tell you why. Uh, this is one thing I wanted to get into. This out the side hole, forcing the butane, so the butane will get stuck in there and like stir up, making it light way easier. And then since the whole thing's closed, the spark has nowhere to go, it has to light it. Uh, I honestly think these are better than the yellow flame, but if you don't, if you don't need it, don't get it. But uh, let's do the wind test. Uh, I had to keep her down. Oh, it wasn't even blowing on it. So blowing wind directly on it, it won't light, but watch this. See, stays lit. So this one, you can point, where if the wind's coming towards you, just keep that back towards you or whatever, right? Whichever direction the wind's going, keep that back towards it and this thing will light every time. Uh, that's the one problem I have with these is if the wind's blowing, it won't light at all. So it did do it there, but I think I was blowing it on my phone a little bit there. I, when I moved forward, it stopped lighting. Uh, I think that's the one problem. But when I'm outside, I just do this like it's a Bic lighter and it works. But as you can see, like the striking, it, it, it's hard to strike up these yellow flame inserts. If you like the whole butane thing and you like the whole yellow flame insert, then you're going to want to get this pipe insert because this thing does just not stop lighting. Like my finger slipped off twice there. You guys probably seen it, but like this thing lights up every time. This is finally a solution to the yellow flame insert. Uh, this thing is wild. It's definitely way more windproof as I shown you here, as long as you're facing the back wall to anything, cause there's no way for the wind to get through only this tiny little hole. So this is definitely more reliable, definitely more wind resistant. Dip, Zippo outdid itself. If you do not have one of these inserts, I highly suggest you go get it. Uh, this this made my day, to be honest. That just lights so much more better. I'll probably never get another yellow flame now. I don't need a regular. I don't need a, a regular yellow flame. I like these. These are much far superior in every way. And I do use a pipe and a bong here and there, so it will be nice to use that in there. Uh, but everyone in the comments, let me know what you think. Did you get one? Are you getting one? Uh, did you ever even hear about this before? Is this your first time hearing about it? Let me know downstairs there. And uh, I'll see you guys again. Thank you very much, Lippy, for sending me these, man. I, I don't know what I would have did without you, buddy. Uh, and don't worry, I'm sending you a big surprise. Uh, I hope you like it. And uh, everyone, take care. I'll see you in the next one. Do not forget to like and subscribe. I can't stress that enough. Make sure to comment, even if you don't have nothing to say, make sure you leave a comment. All right, everyone, take care. See you in the next one.